Hello everyone, welcome to this uh, small but pretty um, interesting uh, Gemini Jets model unboxing. Oh, wait, there's still the paper with all this uh, stuff. So, uh, I've got three models. There's supposed to be five. I don't know what happened uh, to of them. I'm not sure, uh, but I got a paper in the parcel that it's um, it was taking a bit long due to the coronavirus and stuff. Mm. Sorry for the light. Some places down here I see it. Um, yeah, uh, I'm probably most um, surprised. Surprised? No, that's not the best word. Um, happy about those two models. This is for the Hawaii International Airport. That's the uh, Hawaiian Boeing 717. And this is the C-40 uh, U.S. Navy with the patch. Um, it's the limited edition. Oof. It, there were, I think, 200, 200 250? I guess 200, 200 of those were made. Uh, you can Google that. Uh, I checked it before the video. Ma I'm making the video. Here we've got the Copa um, 737 uh, Max 9. It's the longer version. It's pretty long. It's pretty long. And it's with the fully flat beds in business class. And this is the uh, Island Hopper Hawaiian um, Boeing 717. Uh, this is for the Puai. I said that before. Uh, as well, I have the ATR 40, 42 that. So those two will be the regional airplanes. And the rest I've got will be the main line airplanes. I will use this one as well. Um, yeah, what else? Okay, let's do the, um, maybe not the unboxing because I can do that with one hand, but I can show you the boxes from the outs inside, outside. Uh, so we've got the classic, um, you've got the model, it's still in the packets so you can see it correctly. Focus please. Yep, we've got that. Uh, then we've got the information about the airplane. I guess you can see that. And then, sorry for the background, uh, we've got these um, back information. Okay, next we let's make it the Hawaiian. There, okay, focus. Oh, uh, the light kills me. Uh, focus, please. I think it's focused. Okay, let's forget about that and continue. This is the information. McDonnell Douglas. Turn the to develop me whatever. I'm not gonna read that. I read it already. Uh, but there's strange thing. There is no information about this one. It's the Lone Star Express. Uh, so probably many of you know that the Lone Star uh, State is called Texas, and you've got the Texas down here. Uh, so shape down here. Uh, so it's probably I'm not I'm not so into. Uh, those uh, army airplanes, so I won't tell you, uh, but uh, probably due to that, the army airplane, there is no information about the airplane aircraft. Though it's strange because I checked the Wikipedia and it, they had some information about it, so I don't know, a bit strange. Uh, yep, and that's the patch, I'm going to show you that as well. And the airplane was pretty cheap, uh, it was uh, sold for $20 from the main uh, store of. Yeah, uh, of uh, Gemini Jets. Uh, sorry, there's nothing left. Oh, let's leave this one. I'm going to talk for a minute. So, I'm going to first unbox them. I'm going to do a cut down here. Uh, and I'm going to show you those aircrafts uh, when they will be out of the boxes. Yep, so see you in uh, two, two seconds. Yeah, I'm back. Uh, so, we got the mount. Here we got the clipper, C40. I think that's the squadron, I believe. I'm going to do a... A more detailed look in a moment. Um, Copa, there's one thing I can, I think I can see that that this engine is tilted into the um, body side. You can see it's tilted that way, and I looked on it and it looks like it would was glued, but like glued because it went off, fell off. So I believe something happened there. I I don't I know focus focus please yeah focusing focusing yeah focus focus please please down here I can't focus can't focus but yeah like down here maybe you can see it now but 
it looks like it's glued because uh, when I tried a bit to move it it was like uh, probably the most aircraft that I have damaged is because of them arriving in a bad shape uh, often uh, an often thing is a tilted engine I've got that with the top uh, TAP uh, top Portugal uh, I've got that there uh, my I know that I have it uh, on this aircraft, uh, I know on the American A330-200, I've got the uh, forward uh, landing gear tilted. Uh, I've got uh, American A319 Allegheny delivery. I've got the whole part of the wing that's coming off. Yeah, whatever. Uh, that's Gemini Jets, something they could work on. Bit sad. Okay, so uh, I'm gonna make, have a look. Here we've got United States Navy. If you know something more about this plane, oh uh, wait, I'm gonna remove my finger from it. Down here, you can see that it's like the probably the fast change aircraft. I can now show you make the batch flank owner BR59C40A. Uh, where, did it, where was it made? China, US, made with pride in the United States. It's the Squadron Flight Shop. Nice. Uh, so, yeah, let me show you the aircraft. Oh, this is nice. Yep. 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 That's the lower part of it. Yeah, so what I've read about it, it's uh, that it's used for um, transporting soldiers around different places and cargo if it's needed. Okay, let's move. Right here we've got the Hawaiian, Hawaiian one. Let's move out. Okay, that's the... Here we've got the uh, bigger uh, cargo. Thingy. On the back, you've got the smaller one. I don't know what's why that. Why why is that? Uh, the livery is very nice. I think it's the new one. Yeah, it's the new one. But you can see down here, we uh, there on both sides of the wings, we've got. Um, I'm not sure what's that actually. Uh, either I would guess lights. Fuel, no, that's not fuel, like, uh, raid, not raiders, but, like, some pitots or whatever. I know pitots are in the front, but some kind of testers, whatever. I'm not sure. If you know what's this tiny part sticking out, let me know, because I have no idea. Uh, yeah. What else? Yeah, it looks very nice. Very, very nice. And... Now, let's, last but not least, we've got Copa. They've got the nice Max 9 livery on the back. Wait, it's got to be focused. Currently, I'm filming on my uh, camera, so it's not my phone as usual. Because I don't know if uh, you know, but usually I film all those updates and videos on my phone. Let me cancel it. But you can see the... Oh, sorry. The idea, the nice back livery, Max 9, yeah, uh, oh my god, it's raining, okay, <laughs> whatever, uh, it looks very similar to the United livery, I would get, I say so, even the, uh, style of the letters is very similar to the one, the United one, probably, if I would ask my friends uh, that have no idea about airplanes, they would say they don't know what is uh, what's the difference, probably. But we av aviation lovers know the difference, of course. That's the back of it. Of course, of course, we've got the split split uh, winglets. Yep, uh, that's all for today. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I don't know where where there are uh, two more crafts that are ordered. I'm gonna uh, email them. It should be a, a United CRJ 550 
and a uh, Delta uh, Boeing 737-900 or 800. I'm not sure. Um, yeah, but that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed it and see you next time. Bye, guys.